Mailing Blues Fat Team. Yeah! Hello, everyone. That was hard. Here we are. Again. It's been like, what, a week and a half since we've done our last video? We're not sure. doing really good doing these weekly. We're failing. Um, but anyways, what's important is we've made a video it's now. Like just being spontaneous. Yeah. You know, um, kind of like the on TV, like the wives want the husbands to be spontaneous. So we it's spontaneous. Not that we are your husbands when you think, you know, the spice in your life, you know. Boom, it's a video. Boom, it's a video. Boom, cinnamon. Boom, paprika. Anyways, let's get down to it. I'll go first this time. Um, currently I have no idea what I weigh because I will weigh in tomorrow morning because I like I've been freaking out about the weighing, so I told myself I couldn't weigh myself in every day. No doing that for this week at least. So I weighed myself in last Monday morning and then I was what was I? Two sixteen? So tomorrow morning we'll see what I am. Um I've done really legit awesome on exercising this week and not too bad on my eating. Um, Monday I did Richard Simmons Party Off the Pound. Oh, that's a hardcore workout. <laughs> and then um, Tuesday, what did I do Tuesday? Oh, I went for a two and a half mile walk. And then Wednesday I did oh, Tahitian Cardio Dance Hula. Oh, it's the most seductive of all dances. Yeah, right. It's like I'm moving my hips and I'm trying... Oh, you got it. Yeah. Um, it's like you're not supposed to move your upper body. So I'm like, oh my gosh. Like so much focusing. But I'm end up being like, oh, oh, like that. But anyways, good workout. And man, my hips were really sore the next day. Then Thursday I went for another walk. This one was close to about two miles, went for a walk with Matthew, and then Friday I did my um, dance central, one of the fitness things, it was about a half an hour, and that was really fun and pretty hardcore, and then um, I finished up my squat challenge, um, the 31 day squat challenge, Friday with 200 squats, and then today started the app challenge um, for the month of September, and you do what? Sit ups, crunches, leg raises, and planks. Did that today. And we did a 10 second plank, and that was hardcore hard. Oh my gosh, at the end of this, you're supposed to be able to do a two minute plank. Wow. Man, I don't know. But I guess doing it basically every day, you go three days, take a day off, three days, take a day off. So you probably get to build yourself up to it, but. It's going to be hard. So, yeah, and my eating has been, it's like I'm really sick of chicken. I'm so sick of it. I'm so sick of eating the same things over and over. So we're expanding our eating. I actually bought rice. I've got Matt. He's going to try rice as long as it's not white rice. <coughs> yeah, that's his reaction to peas, green beans. Swallow it. It's going to swallow it. You should see his face. He's like... <laughs> If the potatoes mix with it, it's okay. And, and ketchup easily. all over everything. It's okay, it's okay. I can spend an hour making an amazing meal. And he's like, see the ketchup, babe? Ketchup? Like, why even? <laughs> why? Yeah, nice meal. And <laughs> ketchup <laughs> all over it. Hey, so, anyway. It enhances the flavor. It brings out the flavor of the meal, you know? Hey. Yeah. Anyways, um, we took measurements today because Matt's doing the ab challenge, too. And it's like... Where is your ab? Like, for legit seriousness. I did my waist and then around my hips and belly area because that's what I got. So it's like, where is the abs? Is it where the tummy is? Is that your abs? Or is it like up underneath, like, your breasts? Or what? Where are the abdominals? 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 Where are they? Somebody tell me, please, so I can measure myself. But funny thing, my waist was 35 and then BAM! My hips and butt and belly are 55. It's just like, oh, you gained 20 inches, girl. Mm. It's a lot better than it used to be. My hips and stuff used to be in the 70s, so <laughs> <laughs> they've gone down. Man, how many feet wide is that? So anyways, that's it for me. Matt, tell us. 
tell I'll tell you my story. Um, my way. The story of a man named Smiley. It was weed. I've but been hanging around you a really yeah. long time. Um, I weigh two, six, seven, so uh, my plans are failing. Um, and you know what? He promised me that if he didn't hit his goal weight by a certain date. I still see that out the corner of my eye. I'm not <laughs> lying. He would join the gym. Has he joined the gym? Nah. And he's trying to get his way out of it. I didn't say I joined the gym. I, I'd join. I didn't say I'd, I'd go. Yeah. work out with a trainer. You did. Did I? But you don't have to work out with a trainer. Just let's go and work out. Just try it for a month. Cool, baby. It's a... It's a... See, Matt's basic thing, all he needs to really get done is this, this ab. It needs to, uh. needs to decrease and the muscles increase. <laughs> Pretty much, isn't that? I mean, everything else is good. It's just that. That's where it all goes. And that's the worst place because it's strained on your heart. Mm, she's worried about me. I am. She's a good wife. Mm-hmm. And if he just gets more muscly along the way, <laughs> I'll have to deal with it. Yeah. Whatever. Yeah, whatever. He goes around flexing his arm muscles. Feel my muscle. Feel it. <laughs> <Hey>. <laughs> Anyways, continue on, my dear love. Yeah, 267, not going as I had hoped. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to keep doing what I'm doing. Um. <laughs> That's it, because it's been working great. But try a little more and stuff, and with the air thing, I think they'll really, really help out more. I've heard a voice speak to me eating. I've got to improve my eating, I think. I think that's what the voice said. You gotta eat better, you gotta watch your diet. You know, you're eating too much junk food and not enough vegetables. That's what the voice implied. And, and the voice is probably why, because it's a beautiful voice and, and pretty like and stuff. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> anyway, that's about it. That end. Oh, okay. I was going to give an update on my neck. Okay. Because the last time was when I was saying I was going to the doctor. Well, I did go to the doctor, and he said he thinks he narrowed it down between two things called carotididia, which is just pain of the carotid artery, or this thing called Eagle Syndrome. I don't know. Something, something, cal, cal, um, gets calif calcification, calify, calcium, something calcium buildup and puts pressure on some place and causes pain. I don't know. He put me on steroids and then some other drug. I'm finishing up the other drug on Tuesday, Thursday, someday. I go back on September 9th to see what the results are. Um, really, there's a little difference. The pain is eased up a little bit from over here, but it's more intense in here, more like a sore throat, a lot of pain in the sinuses. The thing is, is it's it hinders when I'm singing, and I can't have that. It's we got to get this fixed out because, I mean, I can't sing as hardcore as I used to be able to, without really straining and a lot of pain. It's not like it. It's really hard to describe. And I think people think I'm crazy, but I don't know. But it just it really does make me scared and nervous because I don't want to lose my voice and my ability to sing. Does that make sense? It's like <laughs> something that scares me a lot. So that's what we're going to, and Matt is all nervous about it too. <laughs> yeah, because he's got his serious face on. He's not going to say anything. <laughs> yeah. Didn't realize I'm a psychiatrist. <laughs> you, well, you should have figured it out. Duh. I'm amazing. <laughs> <laughs> Lucky I don't charge you by the hour, boy. <laughs> Actually, I do. I just get paid in Yankee Candles and Nutella. But, and Bath and Body Works, which I think he has more fun buying. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I mean... I do. I mean, it's for my lady. Mm -hmm. Although you did buy that man stuff from Bath and Body Works. <laughs> man oh. stuff. I'm I don't let that out. <laughs> ah, my manliness has been Christian now. Uh. You're manly, baby. Oh. <laughs> Look at this beard. Uh. How could anyone doubt it? Uh, and he buys Dove Man products, too. <laughs> Dove makes noise on my skin, okay? I can't help it. It's so funny where at the store he's like, 
I need to get some dove. <laughs> like, so I'm like, shh, <laughs> don't let anybody know. <laughs> and here I am telling all of you to. <laughs> Yeah, I'll be going, sparkle, sparkle, sparkle! Bang ball! <laughs> Richard Simmons has a new music video about a hairdo. Please go watch it. Especially you, Khalif. <laughs> <laughs> All the other day when Matt and I were walking, some dude yelled out about my fat butt. It's like, why do people yell things out, mean things out at people? And when they do, it's not very creative stuff like Matt pointed out. It's not like they actually thought about it. They're just like, Hey, you fat beep! Fat beep! Beep, 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 beep! It's like, wow, you really showed your intelligence unto me. <laughs> Future of our world right there. <laughs> but, you know, whatevs. My nieces and I yell things out at people, but it's usually just like, hi! My niece barks at people. <laughs> she hasn't done that in a while. And recently I've got them to, they yell out at people, you can achieve your dreams! Something encouraging. Yeah. They, we yelled it out at some group of girls and they're like, thank you! It was just great. I like doing stuff like that and bring smiles to people's faces. But, <laughs> did you like my impression there? Mm -hmm. My don't. I'm in there and I need to shut up. Oh, Matt, so happy. <laughs> hey, I like hearing the voice, but sometimes I want to hear myself think. <laughs> that great. Honesty is the best policy, people. It really is. I've been to get long enough to realize that we're we stuck with each other now. Yeah, we tell so each other the truth all the time. Like, he, okay, people, the pocket on your shirt, it's not for carrying things. Oh it's my for God. lifts only. So every, every time before church service, he's got stuff jammed in there, and I look at him, and I'm like, we've had discussions about this, haven't we? And he's like, what? And then he's like, oh. Let me remove my five pens, camera, bottled water, a bunch of receipts. It's like at church you look at his butt and the butt pockets are all crumpled with from a bunch of receipts in them. I'm like, what's the matter with your butt, man? And then reach, there's like 20 receipts. Let's face it. When you're married, when the man goes out of the house, the wife is held responsible for what he looks like. <laughs> I, I don't know, man. I'm, I'm just... Me, if people kind of see me for who I am, then I don't want nothing to do with them. <laughs> I accept you, I'm just trying to help you. <laughs> so, anyways, we said we were done a while ago, so let's for real be done in this. The smelling blue is fat jeans.